today, and one of our favorite people is David Gunther from J. David's Custom Clothiers. Perfect. Clothiers. perfect. Yeah, well, it's perfect now. I messed it up the first time, but, well, that's but okay. it, it used to be J. David's men, Menswear. Uh, it did. It changed about 20 years ago. See, that, Not that's just dated. Yeah. It's, okay. it's, okay. it's okay. It's all good. I'm all right. I'm all right. I'm good with that. It's a little dated, Dave. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I know, I know, I know. Anyway, let's uh, get into a big event that's starting today. And it's happy birthday to you, by the way. Uh, That's you know, pretty I birthday. had no idea that you even knew that. That doesn't have anything to do with the event. It just happens to be on that day. Well, everybody knows. Everybody yeah, well, knows everything sure. about you, David. Sure. Well, sure. Yeah, That's thank right. you. <laughs> Thanks. You got the memo. I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. I appreciate it. <laughs> that email blast you sent out. Exactly. It's my birthday, people. <laughs> exactly. But we've got a big event going on over at the store, and uh, yes. it's a celebration of your 30 years in business. 30 years of dressing Santa Cruz's best dressed guys. Yeah. So, yeah. Great way to put it. Yeah, and you. Bjorkman. And, and, and Mike. <laughs> and Mike. Uh, well, no, this year actually marks my 20th year of David being my tailor. So it's appropriate. It's perfect. Yeah. And perfect. with an event like this, and, and it's a quick, real quick story. One time my wife called and said, hey, when are you going to have a sale? I want to get some stuff for Mike for Christmas. And David said, we don't have sales. So this event is a really big deal because everything in the entire store is on sale. I'm just shutting down my whole calendar for tomorrow through Sunday or whatever. Yeah, and, and that's it. We're going to hang out and get some new stuff. And what's really cool is the actual custom suit maker, the actual shirt maker, they're flying in for this event. Yeah. So it's not too often I get to bring in stuff and say, hey, what if I did this with that and this? Because most of my stuff is custom. Right. And So for 20 yeah. years, what has kept you coming back? Um, David only mm -hmm. laughs at me a little <laughs> bit when I ask for things. Uh, I'm, I'm a... I'm an I guess, expressive person, and I like to be somewhat different. You know, even on subtle things like, like my shirt I'm wearing today, the collar, totally different material than the rest of the shirt, than the cuffs, you know, things that are different. Uh, and David makes all my pants, and, you know, we brought some of the stuff in here. Uh, I like to do things that are unusual. So I had David make me pants that, that I like to wear, and you could dress these up and wear them stuff. And I, I, see, I see these have been let out a few times, Mike. <laughs> yeah, of course. The these are probably 10 years old. <laughs> but, you know, when you talk about Those that. Those are cool. I they, mean, they are cool. I mean, I dress, you know, in suits and stuff all the time, but you can't get material like this. You can't just go to the mall and pick stuff up like this. Uh, the, I mean, you, they're lined right. all the way through, and they're just, they feel so good when you put them on. There's such a difference. And I work with such, um, you know, a lot of luxury property, and the, the men I'm with are dressed very nice and, you know, you feel comfortable and confident. You know, just little touches, like all the rubber inside, so your shirts don't let untuck. Me, let me ask you right now. I know that this is David's segment. <laughs> hey, yes, yeah, hey, sorry. But no, no I I'm, just, I'm passionate about it. No, but I want to ask you, why is it so important to you to look as good and, as you do and have David do your clothes? Uh, well, you feel good. You feel confident. Uh, it's nice to have the attention, like, where's, you know, just different things like my tuxedo shirts. David makes all my tuxedos. And I don't like to wear ties, so how often do you get to go to a very fancy event and not have to wear a tie because he covered my buttons and made it look fancy? The collar is a banded collar, which people, it stands out and people say, hey, what the heck? The cuff's totally different with your name on it. You know I didn't just go rent this tux somewhere, so when I'm on stage speaking or if I'm at an event, people, it, it stands out and notice it's a good feeling to say, hey, you care about yourself enough to look good. And, you know. Well, the last time, David, you were, you were on the show, um, you guys had asked me, as far as a, wom a woman's point of view, like, what does right. it mean to see a sharp-dressed man? And I used the, I think I believe I said, success. You think successful when you see a man that's dressed sharp. It does make it's a difference. It's so important. Men don't sure. think they throw on their flip-flops and their shorts, and they don't think. It is so <laughs> important for a man to be dressed well. Well, and, and there's no excuse in Santa Cruz for them not to be because they have that you. Is, that is true. And it's, you know, a lot of guys maybe don't put things together quite right or the colors quite right or it's just not their thing. They're paying attention to other things. The nice thing with us is they don't have to think about it. All they need to do is come in or their wife can come in or whatever and we take care of it. Mm -hmm. So we do everything for them. Customer service so. is a huge thing. Like not too long ago I was in uh, the Sheraton Universal. I was on stage at an event. I went the night before. I forgot my pants. So I called up David like 8 o'clock on a Friday night or something. Within a couple hours, my pants were hand-delivered, perfect fit, because I keep all my stuff. And there you go. It saved the day. I didn't have to completely break everything down to come up to get pants or come pick them up. And we, little touches like that. We like, do take care of emergencies. And I have to say this, yeah. this last week on Friday, there's a local attorney who's uh, a part of a, a huge hundreds of millions of dollars lawsuit, and it's in Texas. And he called on Friday. And the, uh, his trial was starting on Monday, 
uh, actually it was last week, he called on Monday and it was Tuesday, his trial was starting, somebody had broke into his car and stole everything out of his car when he flew into Houston. Everything was gone from his computers to all of his clothes, his suits and so forth. So we retailored new suits for him that day, FedExed him that day and he had him in Houston the next morning. Wow. So, th and that was just a week ago. Huge. So it felt good to come through. So tell us about that. the discounts yes. that are going to work. Uh, it's it's multiple days, things. Right? It's okay. it starts today. Okay. So we're excited about this with a big event that we'd love for everybody to come to. Uh, starts at six o'clock with the real event part, although the pricing starts at ten a.m. But we'll have live live music and food and wine, and it's just going to be a fun, lot of energy. We'd love everybody to be there. Uh, but it's everything in the stores on sale. And like Mike had said, it's not that we're better than anybody else. It's just my philosophy of business is as an owner. I don't mark things up to mark them down. I don't mark things way up and then have 75% off sales. I just don't think that's a fair way of doing business. I take a markup that I have to to be able to sell clothes and make a living and be able to offer all the services we do. And we really don't run sales because we don't need to just blow things out the door. So when we do run an event like this or have an event like this, it's kind of exciting. So uh, suits, as an example, custom suits, if you buy one, it's $150 off. If you buy two, it's $200 off each one. If you buy three or more, it's $250 off each suit. So it wow. makes it nice. Uh, our custom slacks, you can buy two pair and get one free. Wow. Uh, custom shirts, I'll throw this out real quick. Buy five custom shirts, get one free, which is something that we do every once in a while. Uh, the fun part today, starting today is uh, for the ladies, actually. The guys come in, they buy five custom shirts, get one free, but then we have purchased some, some uh, VIP grotto gift certificates for the Ivy Day Spa to give to the ladies. So nice. you buy five shirts, you get cool. a free shirt, and you take care of your ladies. So it's, yeah. we know where Anne so Marie's going to be going. Yeah. <laughs> so it's nice. I mean, we have to hang out there. You can't, there's no time really where you can go in and get two pairs of pants and get one free. Right. No, and so, not, that's what I not, said. Not my like, calendar down. I'm not sure. like this and not this quality. You can, you know, have some other things at other places, but not like this. We are, we are starting to kind of run out of a little bit of a time, but, sure. but, but I want to get into these hats. And I want to, I want you to tell the story because this is a custom clothing line that you have created. Correct. And it says Jay Davids and the 25, but this is for David Stroud. It is. And it's actually, and I'll, I can get through this without uh, being emotional about it, but it's to me the most important thing I've done in 30 years. Uh, David Stroud played basketball for Valencia High School. His uh, dad had been a customer of mine for many years, uh, still is. And David loved to dress. And great basketball player, six foot five with an eight pack, the pillar of, of strength and whatever, and was lethargic after practice a little bit. They took him in, had him checked out, thought maybe he had mono or something, had stage four non Hodgkin's lymphoma, uh, passed away last August from, from leukemia. The uh, five days before he passed away, uh, Blake Griffin, who's a client of mine from the Clippers, uh, he went with me to see David in the hospital. It was one of the coolest days of my whole life. And that day, David gave me a hug and said, I just don't want to be forgotten. And a couple days later, I was driving home on the freeway, thought of this idea of doing a clothing line for David called 25 by J. Davids. I texted him. He, the 25 I, being the 25 his being number. his number. Yeah. Texted him, and I didn't even know if he was still alive or not. He texted me back. We, I sat by the side of the freeway, texted back and forth with him for an hour. He told me his favorite color was lime green, so on the hats, it's a 25 in lime green, so 25 by Jay Davids. Uh, when he said he didn't want to be forgotten, uh, he won't ever be forgotten. It's an awesome thing. These are available now at the store. We have uh, ties, shirts, things that are coming in that are labeled that, and I will have that for years, and a percentage of all of those sales will go to Children's Hospital in his uh, scholarship exactly. honor. Wow. So I am Great. thrilled really beyond. Cool. That is so, great. So support that anyways. It's worth it. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. the event begins today, 6 yes. o'clock. Yes. It goes through Sunday. Correct. At J. David's. It's over at the mall. Um, you guys know where it is. Make certain you go and plan, plan to be a part of that. And also think about supporting David Stroud as well. Thank with you that, very guys. much. Thank you very much. Mike, thanks for being here and giving oh, your, your, that your that testimonial. <laughs> <laughs> Jake Happy Tanner, Jake, yeah. Ta Jake Tanner, he wrote Stick It In Your Pie Hole. We're gonna have some food out here that he has prepared, so stay tuned.